Here comes the A-lister. And his opponent, and residing in Hollywood, California. Weighing in at 221 pounds, the Miz. Gentlemen, I would absolutely love to read you a list of accomplishments and accolades that the Miz has on the grand stage, but the truth is, there aren't enough hours in the day. There's no doubt that Miz has really been one of the greats at on the grand stage. He beat John Cena in the main event at WrestleMania. He won the inaugural mixed match challenge with Asuka. He really is the A-lister when it comes to these big time shows. Correct me if I'm wrong, Michael Cole, but WrestleMania 27 was the beginning of your undefeated streak. Which, Indeed. Thanks to The Miz, oh was gosh. must see. We've seen plenty of ladder matches in WWE history, but none quite like this, where the script for the action film, Rank and File 4, has been suspended above the ring in a briefcase. Whoever climbs the ladder and retrieves the script first will win both the match and the starring role. It's a travesty of justice that Miz even has to go through something like this to get a role that should have already been his. He is one of the greatest actors of our time. I don't know about that, but I do know that this lights, camera, action ladder match is going to be a smash hit with audiences and critics worldwide. Saxton, why don't you treat this like we're at the movies? No talking. Pick the most shocking championship win of this decade. I'd have to go with the Miz cashing in the money in the bank on Randy Orton to become WWE champion. Oh, what impact! You know, what my favorite part of SummerSlam is everything. Corey, touching back on Miz's title win you brought up. Even I was surprised, and I was a bit of a Miz fan back then. He was a former reality TV star who unseated a third-generation multi-time champion in Randy Orton. Michael, saying you were a bit of a Miz fan is like saying you kind of like Elias' music. I hate to say it, but the Miz did wisely cash in his Money in the Bank contract and made history that night. Gotta find a way to get out of this There's the escape, guys. I think that move just took a little too long to materialize. Back in the ring again. Perhaps he's thinking the ring can't contain what he has in mind here. His offense is on point right now. If he can sustain this kind of effort, the match is his. Definitely not where you want to be right now. The Miz looking a little bit shaken. It'll take more punishment than that to keep him from the top of the ladder. The Miz with a nice reversal. And now that one's countered. That was impressive, Michael. Both of these competitors have so much resolve, it's going to take a minor mirror. Trey hammers Miz in the corner. It's Brooklyn Von Braun. I had a feeling she'd get involved tonight. Do you blame her? She wants Miz to win so she can have a legitimate co-star in the movie. And here's Red to stop Brooklyn from spoiling this match. This is pure jealousy. Red couldn't beat Brooklyn in the audition, so now she's taking it out on her. That's ridiculous. She's only out here to help her friend, Trey. And it appears she's been able to accomplish that. Red has neutralized Brooklyn as they head to the back. Cut! Cut! There's no cutting in this match. He's looking to align that ladder up perfectly. Placement is crucial. Oh, and the ladder finds 
avoids the mark. Gonna be tough to bounce back from that one. Scoop slam! The Miz definitely in a tough spot now. He's lost much of his early confidence. He's not looking good here, guys. Hold on, guys. This isn't good. Boom! Oh, step up in Zaguri in the corner. Here we go. Hey, he, he could win it here. Taking a bit of a chance here, Cole, and not a very well-calculated one either. Great match here, but if you miss any of the action from this week, just go to WWE's Facebook page, YouTube channel, Twitter, and more to get all caught up. Oh, no, we've got a daredevil on our hands, guys. I love it. What a slam. Impactful. It'll jar your spine. Oh, no. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. He's definitely being the aggressor here. No telling where or when this will end. He's got victory in his grasp, guys. I like the thought process here, but you're going to have to move a lot faster. No matter how you feel about anyone's acting skills, this is a huge night for Trey. He beat a future Hall of Famer in a pressure-filled, high-stakes ladder match at the biggest party in the summer. As far as I'm concerned, Trey deserves the role and our respect. Oh, that's nice, but as of now, I'm officially boycotting rank and file four. Sorry, Brooklyn, I'll just have to catch you in your next film.